Greetings Houston. Greetings YouTube. Random Chaos coming at you on this fine, beautiful day on a Sunday, January 28th, 2024. I am going to be attending, or rather go on to a restaurant called Moon Tower Inn. And today they're having an event going on called Heavy Metal Market and Oddities. And also, uh, the singer, the vocalist of an old local thrash metal band, uh, DRI, known as Dirty Rotten Episodes, is here signing autographs, uh, selling t-shirts, and DRI merchandise. So it's very cool. I've been walking around, checking it out already, getting a feel of the place. Got to go in soon and uh, take some video, and I got some permission to do so. Uh, there's a lot of loud music. There's a DJ in there blasting like black metal music. So um, I'm going to try and talk a lot to try to cover that up, but those speakers are really loud. I can hear it over here. I'm in the lot next door to Moon Tower Inn. But it seems like a fun day to do this and a nice day off and um, might end up buying some merchandise. But anyway, see you there. I was close. I'm getting to, uh, walking up in front of the Moon Tower Inn again. You can already hear the music way out here from the DJs out the, the, the back of the place. So, uh, like I said, good time talk a lot over the music so I don't get a copyright claim. And uh, just, just wish for the best anyway. Uh, seems like a pretty good turnout today here. There's a lot of people, and they just start like at 1 o'clock right today. We can walk in, check out the booze, the merchandise. And, uh, People selling their merch. Selling t shirts. Uh, how you doing, man? Selling vinyls, vinyl CDs, just regular merchandise. They got like a almost any heavy metal band you can think of, black metal, thrash, whatever. There's a lot of people out here selling vinyl, t-shirts, jewelry. Got those miscellaneous stuff. How you doing? Check out these candles here, little skull candles, and one of the middle finger. That's, that's cool. Oh, number one. There you go. Some cats. Hey, those are pretty cool. Those are really nice. Thank you. How much is uh, are they? Uh, you go by size. Twelve or twenty. Everything else is fifteen. Fifteen. All right. I'll keep that in mind. Got an official horse skull. <laughs> That's a lot of vinyl. <laughs> cool. How you doing? How much are your banners? Uh, depends. The shirt's 20. The banners, uh, oh, those are shirts. Okay, I thought they were banners too, medium. Oh, no, no, they're shirts. Okay. All right. Sorry. I'm really paying attention to this old school Slayer shirt. This is awesome. Sadistic Intent. I remember that band. Was this Sadistic Intent, the Houston band? No, no, no. California. Oh, they're from California. Okay. I'm trying to maybe walking in front of the the speakers here blaring music over here. I'm trying not to get a copyright claim, so I'm gonna try and keep talking through here. And uh, what's going on? We got DRI right here. This is the band DRI, old Houston band, been around for 40 years. This is all stuff uh, from. Uh, the vocalist, Kurt Breck. Oh, DRI CDs. Man, this is a good band. I listened to these guys. 
back in my high school days, back in the 80s. So these guys have been around for a long time. This is the lead singer, Kurt from uh, DRI, man. Nice to meet you. So, uh, I get the camera right up there good. So what do you guys, do you guys stay in Houston still, or are you? I live in Houston. You live in Houston again, yeah, okay. You guys went out to California for a while. And, uh, yeah, I've been listening to DRI since the 80s, man. You know, it's been some good times there. Got me through a lot of stuff. And I think you guys played shows in my friend's band. My friend has a band in New Hampshire, Candy Shopper Death Orgy. Yeah. Eric Payone. Good friend of mine. a friend of mine, yeah, yeah, yeah. I used to live up in that area. I played with those guys this year. Oh, you did? Okay. I haven't heard from him much lately. I know he has a Facebook, but, uh, yeah. All right, I'll have to show him this later, too, man. All right, and let's go to the merchandise here. All right, oh. This is also another project that uh, DRI does, Napalm, uh, Pasadena Napalm Division. And honestly, I gotta check that out more, listen to it more. <laughs> but I, I'm gonna get away, the, the speakers here are like really crazy. So there's gotta be a poster of DRI being signed by Kurt. Hang that up on my wall in my studio. Hey, appreciate it, man. You have a good one. Thanks for coming out. And uh, we'll see you in concert soon. I definitely gotta be um, checking out that band out. I've actually never seen DRI play live. I should have in the past, but I just never had the chance. And uh, like he said, they're gonna be back in December uh, 2024. So it's gonna be a while, but definitely they play around Houston again. I'll be definitely checking that out. Uh, hopefully, Napalm Division also, Pasadena Napalm Division, will be playing uh, Sunday too. And um, get that done. Anyway, see you in a minute. over here I gotta check out I'm definitely gonna buy some t-shirts one guy is like that's some really cool t-shirts I've been looking for and there's a, like an interesting one I really want to get eventually uh, I don't know if I'm gonna get it here today or how rare this is but uh Cavalier's taste is just a little different I was seeing this t-shirt here Dahmer's Diner serving Milwaukee since 1990 <laughs> I love that shirt uh, some cool uh Old Motorhead T-shirts. Oh, no. yeah. For the Christmas season shirt. Oh, the Anthrax T-shirts, man. The stickers, patches, whatnot. I think I may actually have a Old Slayer patch here. This is like an old school one. I'm a big Slayer fan since I don't know how long. They're carrying the action figures of Iron Maiden and uh, Rancid. They got the old Motorhead war pick figurine. <laughs> yeah, this is a pretty cool event out here today, so I'm glad I came out here. I'm glad I found out a day off from work, too. Another old Slayer. Uh, Bunch of metal pins for your leather jacket or denim jacket, whatever you want to put it on. Some really nice ones here. And ba even Bad Religion. Kiss Army right there. That's a cool shirt here. Merciful Fate, Old King Diamond Band. A bunch of Halloween mask here for sale. I like this one, uh, Cthulhu over here. A nice guitar, man. That's a really nice guitar, guitar case. Definitely awesome. 
two other guitars over here. Nice bass guitar. Now I'd like to play that bass. Definitely would. Bunch of old cassette tapes, and they got a Black Flag, Black Sabbath, Megadeth, uh, Pocket knives and some uh, tobacco pipes, a pair of binoculars, and uh, I like this man. That's a nice uh, multi-tool there. Something I need for work. Little pins here. Your hats or jackets. This is really a cool day right here, man. This is a very good event. They do this often in Houston. Uh, they have a swap uh, uh, meet like this. Um, I don't always get to go to these things because of work, but uh, definitely glad I came out today. I was checking out this uh, merch table a while ago. A lot of really cool t-shirts on this one. I was noticing the, the Subhumans, GBH, a lot of punk and metal t-shirts here. Doom, I remember them. Casualties. I actually used to see those guys casualties when I was in New York City. Chaos UK, great band. I've seen them once in Boston. Extreme Noise Terror. There's some banners down here. The death metal logo for Selena. <laughs> hey, true story. Selena was born in the same hospital I was in Freeport. ACAB, all cats are beautiful. <laughs> That's pretty cool. One old crass t shirt right here. Well, that was a fun event. Got it. Got out for a day. Had a day off. Went out. Checked out some good. Heard some good music. And uh, and let you know all that loud background music. I have nothing to do with it. I do not own it. I do not claim it. It was just there. I'm making my video. I tried to talk over it to drown some of it out. Don't know how well it's gonna work. But anyway, had a fun time out there. Met Kurt from DRI. Bought a few things from uh from him. And uh, some patches and stickers and a. Uh, poster I'm gonna be hanging up and had a monograph which is really nice of them to do that you know and uh, a lot of people a lot of bands don't always just want to come out and do something like this but uh, DRI has been around for like 43 uh, years now 42 43 and they are a Houston band and he was saying I was talking to a while ago off camera and they are back in Houston and they also have the product I don't I need to look into the pro other project Napalm Pasadena Napalm Division see if that's still a thing you know i need to check that out but uh you know but definitely check out their music if you're not familiar with their music dri great thrash metal band so if you want to check out something new check it out dri stands for dirty rotten imbeciles so check them out check out pasadena napon division give it a listen you know you get into it you get into it it's, it's worth listening to it trust me i've been listening to them on and off since uh, high school in the 80s and uh they still rock and you know, I'm still into music. I'm still on thrash metal, punk, hardcore, death metal, black metal, anything. You know, if I like it, I like it. And it's just not metal. And you know, I like all genres of music. You know, you, you gotta have an open mind. So that's what I do. Uh, anyway, until next time, I can bring some more random chaos. Stay awesome. Stay sweet. Stay rocking. Stay metal. Stay hardcore. Whatever you choose. See you next time. I got me some merchandise, yeah, as I was saying, the P Pasadena Napalm Division back patch, a couple of Thrash Zone stickers from DRI, and I got one of their old flyers from a show in uh, Fresno, California, DRI with Deathwish and Fox, F-U-X, and Kurt's autograph on the poster he just did a while ago, came out really cool. Thanks, Kurt.